Uh, Prince George's County police are investigating a double homicide in Laurel, where two people were found dead in an, ap in an apartment on Muir Kirk Road this morning. But an adult with special needs was alive inside. Maryland Bureau Chief Brad Bell joins us to tell us more about this. Brad. Really on tragic story and tonight in this area the hunt is on for a killer or killers and two large extended families say they are devastated by this loss. According to relatives the victims are 45 year old Tina Toller and her boyfriend James Ferguson. He is also in his 40s. As word of their death spread this morning family rushed to the scene. When they heard the terrible news, they struggled to understand why anyone would kill the ones they loved. My brother would look out and help anyone. As far as I know, he's very respectful. And he's going to be truly, gratefully missed. I don't know. It's just disbelief. She was nice. I mean, uh, it's just good people. I don't know. It's just hard right now. The couple and the horrible crime scene were discovered by a caregiver coming to the house to tend to Toller's severely disabled 24-year-old daughter. Police found her unharmed but transported her to a hospital for observation. Police say it is clear this was not a murder-suicide. There are multiple signs of trauma to both the male and the female victim. Detectives also know that neighbors heard an argument in the apartment at about 5 a.m. this morning, and police have been here before, twice in February when Toller was reported missing, and then when she returned home, and then more recently for a 911 call hang-up. Neighbors say they saw warning signs that all was not well in the home. You know, it was a lot of people coming in and out of his household. Um, you know, he drunk a lot. Still a good dude. Well, despite those comments from the neighbors, police sources are telling us that this case is wide open. It remains an absolute mystery. In Laurel, Brad Bell, ABC 7 News. Okay, Brad.